Hey, what's going on YouTube? Alabama Reloader here. It is 5.01, left the house about five minutes ago, or a few minutes ago, and we are rolling. It is time to head to Kentucky for the bow opener. Uh, today's August 31st. <clears throat> yeah, August 31st. No, today's September 1st. That's right, today's September 1st. Uh, their opener starts September 2nd. So, heading up there, gonna go meet up with my brother, pick him up. There'll probably be more, there'll probably be more of the, the footage from the entire trip posted over on his YouTube channel uh, called The Snared Life. If you guys wanna go check that out, I'll just mention his channel down in the description below but i'll try to film a little bit it's not going to be uh, it's not going to be super high quality i'll be filming everything through my phone but i'll try to capture some moments hopefully get some hunts on camera and uh yeah we'll just we'll go from there so gotta run over got about an hour uh before i meet up with him and pick him up and then we'll be northbound so Y'all stay tuned. Oh yeah. Got two pairs of gators done. That'll work. So here we go. Got the snared life. Joining the team. Let's go to Kentucky. Let's go. It's uh, about 6 a.m. at an undisclosed location, AKA my cousin's house, her and her husband. We're leaving one of the vehicles here, so getting loaded up and we'll head out. As soon as, as soon as he's ready to go, take your time. All right, let's roll. The Buckies. Time to head to Buckies. Buckies. Time to head to Boosies. What is it? 130 something gas pumps or whatever it is. Head in there and get a biscuit. Maybe some beef jerky. We're gonna be on the road. Head north. Why well, you got your dog in the back? Yeah, exactly. He, he likes to ride back here. Yep, he likes riding back here. That's why he's sliding. 6 a.m. He likes riding back here. Alrighty. Let's go get us a brisket biscuit. I had two shots of espresso. Yeah, I've had one cup of coffee already. Alright, we are in the town of Bucky. Basically, what this place looks like. Go find a gas pump, fill her up, hit the road. Oh, yeah, right here in front of the door. Let's roll. All right. We should get checked into the hotel. Checked in. Checked in. Diamond status. So, just got checked into the hotel. Time to grab a bite to eat and go pull trail cameras. Yep. And then uh, do a little walking and make a game plan for tomorrow. So, 11 o'clock. So, plenty of time. All right. Let's go uh, get some chow. It's opening day. <laughs> opening day. <laughs> the Kentucky bow opener. We gotta go get some coffee. Oh, so coffee maker's broke. Coffee maker's broke at the hotel. I mean, I got one in the room, but the room and the coffee in the room's terrible. All right, All right let's go, Dad. Oh, 
dad made it up last night around 10 30 so now we're heading out gonna go get some coffee head to the spot so we'll see what happens y'all stay tuned what'd you say what are we here for what do you say it's go time all right about an hour later we made it to the spot <coughs> we're going we're going to walk in and well first we gotta get ready still in shorts but all right we gotta get ready and uh we're going to walk in and put the mohican sneaking on them see if we can't kill something ain't that right mm -hmm. all right let's roll So, didn't update you last night, didn't see anything. Uh, well, at least I didn't see anything. Brother ended up seeing five, five does. Dad didn't see anything. It was late, we got back, grabbed a bite to eat, crashed at the hotel, and then uh, overslept slightly this morning. Yeah, we did. Yeah, we did. Uh, my alarm went off at 3.30, I got up, and I guess I just turned it off and then woke up at like seven so uh so we're got something to eat got some coffee now we're heading in we're gonna go to a few different spots and see what we can see hopefully we'll catch something uh slipping through and making a mistake just plan. That's the plan. Just like Zach said, it's time to kill. It's a good day for something to die, so we'll see. Y'all stay tuned.
so dropped off my brother at a different spot um, third morning so Monday morning 5 11 a.m. and we're rolling so dropped off my brother to a spot uh, recap of yesterday um, you know you saw the video of the doe that I got on camera so there was actually another doe and a spotted fawn off to the right that I didn't get on video um, while that one was out walking around that I filmed and then had another doe come through that was at about 2 30 they came out and then had another doe come through at around six so yesterday was a better day actually saw some deer so that was nice and then let's see dad didn't see anything my brother didn't see anything so but day three oh well hello well hey what are you doing? Meh. Meh. Hey, what are you doing? Go on somewhere. Meh. Alright, so that was cool. Um, deer just standing on the road. He looked like a little, looked like a spike, cow horn spike. Uh, looked like he had a little bitty fork. So, possibly a three point, but. That was cool. He just stood there the whole time. Didn't move. All right. But, yeah, rolling in. Going to head back. I'm actually going to go set up in the same place I was at yesterday afternoon. Um, hunted there. I got set up yesterday about 1130. Since we overslept or whatever, I made it in and got set up. It was about 1130 when I was up a tree and then came out around probably 745 740 745 when I walked out it just got too dark to see at that point um, so I'm gonna head back in there and today we're only hunting in the morning got to get on the road uh, let's see I need to be picking up my brother at his spot I need to be picking him up by 12 so we can get on the road back home oh well that possum about he, he about got destroyed luckily he stayed in the middle of the vehicle didn't get hit so that's the plan gonna run over here get set up hopefully fingers crossed uh, get a buck on the ground between one of us today so all right let's get after it y'all stay tuned well <clears throat> the trip didn't go as planned we ended up not killing anything heading out right now uh, we were the plan was to hunt until around 11 and then uh, come out and get on the road and be on the road head home by around 12 it'll be about a five hour drive I gotta get back drop my brother off to pick up his vehicle and then head home from there so I think it'll end up being about a five hour drive so trying to trying to get back before it's too late gotta get up go to work tomorrow so but man what a what an awesome trip overall ton of fun getting to hang out with my dad and my brother just a whole lot of fun doing that <clears throat> seeing those four does or three does and a little spotted fawn yesterday that was pretty awesome went back in climbed the same place this morning i uh, just didn't have any luck and so yeah that's uh that is the Kentucky bow hunting trip for 2023. And now the plan has been bow hunt the opener, uh, the opener weekend, which we just finished up, and then come back in November for a gun hunt during the rut. So that's kind of the plan now. We'll see if I actually get to make it on that trip or not. <laughs> I got some work stuff going on around that time frame, so might not actually get to come back up for the gun hunt. So if not, it was a blast. Wish we could have killed something, but it was still a ton of fun. And yeah, so that's it for now. We'll, uh, we'll catch y'all next time. Y'all have a good one.